Hello friends, I hope you all doing well. So today guys, there will be a new series of leveling and pumping the altar. I have said more than once that the altar boosts your account very well. Primarily attack and health, but there are other things and uh, the altar gives you. Speaking one of the bonuses, the healing effect of the red heart will give you more health when you drop hearts and chapters. This can play an important role in your playthrough, guys. The altar also increases the base performance of the hero and gives the percentage of, of equipment falling out in chapters. So friends, uh, the biggest graduated from you is to subscribe to the channel and like this video. Do not forget to do all this action, please, guys. And if you share this video with your friends, it will be much, much better, guys. So guys, I recorded the last video of pumping the altar on April 8th. It was pumping the altar from level 40 to 50. I think you watched this video. If you didn't watch it, just check it. I have already on my account. Uh, it didn't take a long and not enough time for me to able to collect Bloodsucker Stones to pump the altar from level 50 to level 60. And today we will find out if 5340 Bloodsucker Stones are enough for me to upgrade the altar to level 60, guys. And I think it's worth it. Each lever level 300 stones are taken from us which is a lot considering that maximum of seven pieces fall when farming very sorry to part uh, with what took so long to collect guys but friends i really want to see what kind of bonuses they will give me in fact and how much attack and health i can get in additional and here is the next pumping already takes 350 stones from us uh, for stone farm i use heroic chapter 21 as for me bloodsucker stones drops are the best from this chapter well guys we got to the progress of the altar and this is the most expensive part of the uh, pumping the altar uh, it's a pity that the developers never fix the certain problem it's a very pity I would make life easier for everyone and save a lot of time. You see that I have to look for the material that I want to donate. I think you also face this. Well, nothing. As I said before, it is best to sacrifice pets, guys. They do not play a big role in the game yet. The main thing is to choose a skeleton pets for yourself, upgrade them to the mythical gradation, and you can safely sacrifice all the rest one because you don't really need those guys. Yes, I understand that quite recently the developers have added bonuses to the pets from bosses and mobs from the farm, but while you upgrade the farm, you will collect like 100 more times and even more so you will have to main ones don't don't don't, don't worry about it just sacrifice them all if you don't re already have pets that you would like to donate focus on the rings guys but you need to understand that the ring of the bull is the top one bull ring don't donate it just collect them and upgrade them one one and uh, no case should be powered into the altar don't do this if you want to see the beautiful numbers in your attack graph then you should also leave lion rings lion rings also cool guys don't donate them but you can donate other ones you can also safely donate all other other rings uh, how do i do it you're just gonna watch this if you have not seen the video where I tell you which ring is top, I will leave a link uh, and you can watch it under this video. Just click it and watch it. This is awesome, guys. We will already feel in progress and let's see what we would get in fact. We have been collecting so far long and now with one click we will ash it to level 60. And so we get red heart healing effect, apply 5%, basis sparmers increase by 3%, and equipment can drop chance increases from 15 to 18%. Uh, that's pretty much it what we got, guys. Uh, it's a pity guys of course that in this rolling of the altar there is no increase in attack and health that's so pity and sucks guys and just look from level 60 to 61 you already needed 400 bloodsucker stone can you imagine that's lots 
but okay we will do this there's no problem for us so let's now look at how much our attack and health have increased so we got plus 209 attacked it's not much i think it's not at all for me for my for my hero it's just so low uh, i would like uh, like have 679 health uh, this is how the altar roller turned out from level 50 to 60 guys it took me 5250 bloodsucker stones and if we talk about time then it's little more than one month if you want to upgrade your altar too be sure to focus on the chapters of the heroic mod well friends i hope you liked this video be sure to leave your comments i answer anyone who asks questions and don't forget to subscribe to the channel Thank you all guys and see you soon. Bye bye.